Good morning, guys. I hope you are having a great day. I am about to get dressed, go to church, and then go run some errands and go shopping. And I'm taking my daughter with me, and I think my mom's coming with me as well. So it's a little bit different day today, um, but I wanted to go shopping and just take you along with me. So let's go ahead and get into this video. Now my favorite store in my local mall is Altered State. I really love their clothes. They have some more fancier clothes like I'm showing you here, but they also have more of a style that I love, like the flare jeans and the t-shirts and just the, um, the relaxed look. And I just love the store. Every time I go, go into the store, it smells so good. The people in the store are so sweet and nice. And I just, I just love everything about this store. Even the dressing rooms are really nice. Like they don't have the overhead lighting. They have the lighting by the mirror. So it makes you look so much better than, than the overhead lighting. But yeah, they have so much stuff here to choose from. And I'm really digging these boots right here. Oh my gosh, I had to pick those up and try them on with that t-shirt, that Nashville t-shirt that you're spotting right there. But they have so many styles. Um, they have everything that you're looking for, all the trendy new stuff. Now it is a little bit more expensive than I would like to spend, but these make really good gift ideas. Like if you're buying for your mom or your your sister, or sister-in-law, your friends, or just yourself as well, like treating yourself to something, then this store is really nice. So I'm gonna show you a few more looks of this store and then I will try some stuff on. First outfit up is the Camilla sweater. I have this on in an extra small small and it is true to size. Now this is a 100% polyester sweater and as you can see it's a little bit oversized and that is the look that um, is it's supposed to look like that. <laughs> Uh, this is $70 and it is not the softest sweater, but it isn't itchy at all. Uh, it is kind of in between. So I did like it. And the pants that I have on are the Taylor Flair jeans in a size five. Now all of these sizes and jeans are junior sizes. So if you were a four, just size up to a five. If you are a six, size up to a seven. Now these jeans are $69.95, they are 64% cotton, 31% polyester, 3% rayon, and 2% spandex. I really like them. I think they fit great. Um, they were maybe a tiny bit loose in the waist, especially in the back where it gaps, but if you don't have that problem, then I think you would really like this. For outfit number two, I have on this darling Nashville cropped tee. It is $40, it's true to size. I have on a size small. It's 64% cotton, 31% polyester, 3% rayon, 2% spandex, and I am absolutely in love with this tee. I really wanted to get it, and I probably will when it goes on sale. I just I can't imagine spending $40 on a t-shirt, but it is beautiful. I love it. I cannot say enough about this t-shirt. I just really, really love it. Of course, I'm, an, I'm a Tennessee girl, so I would love the Nashville t-shirt. Definitely recommend getting this, especially when it goes on sale. Now, I still have on the Taylor Flair jeans, but the shoes are called the Emory Booties, and they are cowhide booties, and they are amazing. They are true to size. $70. I have never seen anything like this before, so they are kind of like a trendy item but they're really cute. Definitely recommend them if you like them. 
Outfit number three is this smiley faced oversized tee in a small medium. And it is $45 and it's 100% cotton. Now, I think it is a little bit overpriced for what it is, but if you like it and, and you think it's cute, definitely pick it up. It's really soft. Everything fits. I really like the fit of it. You could wear it with shorts. You could wear it with, you know, the biker shorts. I know that look is really trending right now. I have it on with the Tinley white flare jeans. I did not like these jeans. There was too much bunching in the waist, as you can see, but they were really tight on my legs. So it was a weird fit for me. But if you have a problem with pants fitting your waist and not, or, and fitting your legs, like if you have skinnier legs than me and maybe a wider waist, then these might work for you. They are $70 at 98% cotton, 2% spandex. Outfit number four is the Daisy Oversized Pullover. This comes in at $70. I got this in a small and I think it is true to sized. It's supposed to be a bit oversized as you can see on how it looks on me. And I have this on with the Galveston flare jeans and the flare jeans are, I, I thought they were amazing. They were a tiny bit, bit uh, big on my waist and tight on my, my thighs, but I mean, that's just, Par for the course <laughs> for me. Uh, I The jeans are $69.95 and I got a size 5 which I think is true to size. So I really like these jeans. As you can see they fit really good. They're not too big around the waist but they, they did have a little bit of room in the back. I just wish they were a little bit higher rise. But if you like the mid-rise jeans then these are perfect for you. And I do think that the length is perfect as well with heels or with sandals. I think they'd be great for the spring and summertime as well. I just really, really liked these jeans. And as you can see, the side seam is not curving too much, which is a plus as well. I, I think when it curves too much, it just doesn't look very good. It just kind of looks cheap. So I really like these jeans. Next up is the Sammy jumpsuit, and this is kind of like a linen material. It's 70% rayon, 30% linen. It is $80, so it's a bit expensive for what I would price it as. Um, I have this on a small, and I think it is true to size. Uh, if you are a bit busty like me, it's a little bit tight, but not too tight. Um, the belt is adjustable, and I really like the wide leg. Um, pants that you can see here they're really wide leg and they have pockets which is amazing this would be like a really good easter outfit the only thing that i don't like about this it is a bit it feels like a, a bit low uh, especially in the back as well i didn't like that part but if you like it and you're not as busty as me i think you might i like this a little bit better than i did but it was really darling and now I was changed back into my outfit that I was wearing shopping. So I have on this really oversized cardigan with a tank underneath and the page jeans and my free people boots from AS98. Hi everyone. So today is going to be a come shopping with me and run some errands and things like that. Um, I already got a lot of things done. We went to church and then we went to the mall. I had my mom with me and my daughter, but now they I took them back to their house because I have to go to um, get waxed. So I am about to head in right now. I have like eight minutes to get in there. <laughs> so plenty of time. So I just wanted to quick, quickly just hop on here. I got my Starbucks. I always get the same thing. It's just um, Earl Grey tea with a splash of almond milk and one packet of stevia and it makes the perfect London fog. Uh, the usual place I go to in town was not open. They're not open on Sundays so I wasn't able to get their London fog which is unbelievable and if you're in the Chattanooga area or the Cleveland area uh, it's called Vibes Coffee and they have the best London fog. It's just a drive through You can't go in or anything like that which is fine with me. Um, so anyways, I just went by Starbucks and got their London Fog just to hold me over until later. I do have to go. I was going to go to Aerie that is in Hamilton Place Mall, which is in Chattanooga. Um, 
didn't have time, but I did go to Altered State, and as you saw, there were lots of cute things in there. Holy cow. I wanted to grab everything and try them on, but I just grabbed a few things because I didn't have that much time. Um, probably shouldn't have eaten there. That took up too much time, but you cannot go to the mall and not get that place. What is it? Sek Sakura? Sakura? Something like that, but it's just the best teriyaki chicken. So that's what we did. But I'm going to go to American Eagle. There's another mall here in Cleveland that um, has an American Eagle in it. I don't know if they have an Aerie in there. I don't think that they do. So I might go back another day to Aerie and try on a few things there. I also want to go to Athleta, which is over there by Hamilton Place. Um, so I won't get to that today, sadly, but there's not enough time in the day. But I will go to American Eagle and I will go to Target and try on a few things there as well because they, I think they did bring in their spring stuff. So we'll see what they have. <sighs> Anyways, I'm going to go into the place that I get waxed at. It's called Honey Bunny and they have the best prices in town. They have one in the Cleveland area, which is where I'm at right now. They also have one downtown chat and they have one at Hamilton Place. And they also have one in Hickson. These are all areas around Chattanooga. If you guys didn't know, Chattanooga is really big. Um, it, it's just, it just keeps on growing and growing and growing. And like all, there's so many towns around Chattanooga. So there's Udwal, there's Cleveland, which is where I'm at. Um, there's Hickson, there's Eastridge, there's Brainerd, there's East Brainerd. There is Signal Mountain. Lookout Mountain. There are so many places around Chattanooga and it just, so when we say Chattanooga, anybody that lives here, they'll say they live in Chattanooga just because it's like the easiest thing to say instead of saying, oh, I live in Hickson or I live in Udwal or, um, I grew up in Udwal and I'm going to put the word up here because it's so, it's, it's funny when people are not from Udwal, they say Ultawal. Or, or something. They say something weird, and I'm like, no, it's Udwal. <laughs> Anyways, um, we live in Cleveland now. We'd love to live in Udwal at some point, but um, Cleveland is just as nice. They have all kinds of stuff here, and they have, yeah, they have everything we need. My kids go to school here in, in Cleveland, too, so it's nice. But anyways, I'm going to go in here, and I will catch you guys later. Okay, now we are at American Eagle, and the first outfit I have on is the AE Super Soft Notch Neck Sweatshirt. It is $50. I have on a small. I think it's true to size, and it's so comfortable. It's so soft. I'm always impressed with the materials that American Eagle has. I just, they're just amazing. And for the pants, I have on the um, Ripped Mom Jean in Cool Classic. They are $50. I have on a, a short four and they are true to size. I really like the length of the short size. These are 95% cotton and 5% polyester. So it's a really good outfit. I love it. I definitely recommend these mom jeans. I think they're great. Um, I love the Gap mom jeans, but they don't have those anymore. The ones that I like, the ones I bought a few years ago, but these are a close second for me. Outfit number two, I have a crochet sweater on and I actually have a lace cami on underneath that and I've linked both, but the crochet sweater is $60. It is a small that I have on, which I think is true to size. I love all the colors on it. It was just, it stood out in the store and it just felt amazing. It's 100% cotton and I definitely recommend this if you like it. It is a cropped length, but it's not too cropped, I don't think, especially if you have a tank on underneath. Now the lace cami, I sized up to a medium. They're really small. They're $15 and 100% cotton. I would rather have the ones from Target. I think they are less expensive and just as good. Now the pants are the next level, super high-waisted flare jeans. I have these in a different color, but I wanted to try these here. I have on a four regular length. I would like them to be a bit longer, but they do sell long sizes online. And they are 71% cotton, 21% viscose, 7% polyester, 1% elastane. So they do move with you. Uh, they're very comfortable. I love these jeans. I definitely recommend them. 
Now, if you do end up buying these, make sure that you do hang dry these because they do have elastane in them and some other materials that cannot be dried in the dryer. Same pants, just the flare jeans that I just talked about, but I threw on this Led Zeppelin graphic tee. This comes in at $25 and it's 100% cotton. I'm really, really loving the longer sleeves that most companies are coming out with right now because you can roll them up if you want or you can leave them like this. I know a lot of women out there don't like their upper arms so they kind of want to cover them and this is perfect for that. Now this t-shirt is a great length. It's not cropped, it's not too long. It, I, I think it's just perfect and you can tie it in a knot. I know the mannequin that showed this t-shirt in the store had it tied in a knot and it was really, really cute. So I definitely recommend this t-shirt. I really loved it and wanted to buy it, but I didn't. Now this plaid shirt that I have on here is not available online anymore, but check Poshmark first. And then if they don't have it there, you could always check your local store to see if they have it in the clearance section. Now I have it on with the ripped low rise Tom girl jeans and I really love these jeans. I know a lot of you were wanting to see more low rise and mid rise jeans. So these are for you. I really like them. They are 100% cotton. I have on a size four regular length here and I would say that they are true to size. Online, they do cuff them at the bottom and they look really cute online as well. Um, I, I don't know what else to I don't know what else to say about these jeans, but they are really comfortable. They move with you. There's plenty of room in them. They're not too tight, not too loose. I just really, really like these jeans. Next up is this oversized graphic tee. I have this on in a small and it is $20. I really like the print on this and the fit, the long sleeves, just the length of it is really nice as well. You can front tuck it, you can tie it and knot. I just really like this t-shirt. It's so comfortable. It has that like vintage feel to it. And I believe it is 100% cotton. So it does have that really nice material. Oh, I just love this t-shirt. It is so nice. Now I have it on with these 90s wide leg jeans. They are on sale right now for $38. I have on a size four and they are too tight around the hips and the butt area. I just definitely recommend sizing up. And if you don't like these particular ones, I do have some wide leg jeans that I really love. So you can, I'm going to link those as well, but these are, these are great. They're just really, really tight around my hip area. Um, they are 100% cotton, so they are a really good material. So I really like that. They're not too high. I don't think, um, they are, I would say that they are like a mid rise jeans, and yeah, they're just really comfortable and they look nice. So I definitely recommend these, just maybe size up a little bit. For outfit number six, I have on the super high-waisted flare jean that I showed you earlier with the clubhouse cropped shirt. Now I have this on in a small. I do think it's true to size and it is 100% cotton. It's a really nice material. I really love it. I love how they have different patterns here like the cuff is a different pattern the sleeves are a darker pink stripe and I love how one side of the shirt is striped and the other one isn't it's just got a little bit of a different look to it the cropped length is not too cropped and it's it's just perfect like you can tuck the front in if you wanted to or you know wear a tank top underneath it like I have on here it has um the, the tank underneath is called the True Tank. It's $15 and I sized up to a medium. Outfit number seven is this oversized military shirt hoodie. This is $55 and I have it on in a small. It is oversized. It even says that in the name. <laughs> it has a drawstring hoodie and it has a few buttons in the front. Uh, it does have pockets in the front as well. The the shirt sleeves have a button at the cuff, so you can roll these up if you want. I like the drawstring at the waist because you can loosen it up or tighten it as much as you want to give it that tucked in look. Yeah, overall, I, I like this. It was just a little bit of a stiff material, even though it's 100% cotton. But after a few washes, I think it would loosen up a bit and fit more relaxed. Now I paired this with the ripped low rise Tom girl jeans and I'm going to show you the fit of these. I know I didn't do that earlier. 
These have a really nice fit. They are low rise. So these are for the girls that have wanted some low rise jeans. Uh, I do like the relaxed look of them. I think they fit great. The, the side seam is fine. It does not too curved. Uh, the, the distressing I think is perfect as well. It hits my knees, which it's supposed to. And online, like I said, they do have them cuffed. So it's a little bit of a different look there. Outfit number eight is the Sidekick Shrunken Sweatshirts. Now I have this on with my Margot skinny jeans. I will link these, but sides down. Now this sweatshirt is really soft. It has that really soft like fleece material on the inside throughout the whole sweatshirt. It was really nice. Um, they do have some joggers that I'm gonna show you that match this, but I wouldn't wear it with the joggers. I would wear it how I have it on right here because I'm not a big fan of wearing joggers out of the house, but <laughs> this is how I would wear it. I really like the sweatshirt. It's really cute and has little details on the sweatshirt. And they also carried over the little knitted details on the pants as well, the joggers. Um, as you can see, they fit really good. I think they are true to size. They're a bit oversized, um, loose fitting, and I think that's how they should fit. They do have pockets, which is nice. I always, always like the pockets and they are nice and high rise as well. The bottom is like elastic cuff, so it won't, it, you can bunch it up if you want to. Now the sweatshirt is $50 and it's 60% cotton, 40% polyester, and the pants are as well, but the pants were on sale for $30. So I don't know how long that sale will last, but if you hurry up and go get them, you should be able to get the sale. All right, I know I told you guys that we were going to go over the, all the Target stuff that I found, and I did go to Target, I promise I did, but it was the video was getting too long. So I cut it up into two videos. I'm going to post the Target video later this week, either Wednesday or Thursday. I'm gonna to try to get it up on Wednesday, but it might be Thursday uh, because I forgot to take pictures of the price tags and everything like that. So I gotta kinda of remember what I got and what sizes I got. I think I remember, I think there was only like one or two that I sized up or down in, but I will try to remember to do that. Um, I hate that I forgot that. It, anyways, I hope you like this today's video. It's a little bit different for me. I know I haven't done these in a long time. I'm out of practice for doing shop with me videos. So next time I'll keep it to like two or three outfits per store so I can get more stores in. I'm not spending so much time in one store and it won't be as much time in, in the video with the store either. So I think I can kind of I think I can kind of tweak the video so it's a little bit better next time. So make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. And if you didn't, you can give it a thumbs down. That's okay. It just tells me that I need to improve on the video. I mean, no big deal. If you want to subscribe, I upload every Monday. I've been pretty good about uploading on every Monday. And I'm pretty proud of myself because I'm not always the most reliable person in the world. But this week you're gonna get extra content. So make sure you hit that bell notification so you are notified when I post that video. And as always, when you leave comments, it means so much to me. Thank you for taking the time out of your busy day to comment on my video. I It means the world to me, so thank you so much. And I will see you soon. Bye guys. <laughs>